Hello everybody, it's Itchy here, and once again I am back with another add-on. Today, we are checking out the OP, uh, OP? <laughs> the OP bows by 4K Studios, as you can see behind me, so be sure to check them out. And if you like the looks of these mods, uh, it's on the Minecraft store, for like six bucks. Not bad. So I'm going to use a slimes, in hopes that I get a big slime, because, uh, It'll just be a good test to see, you know, what the AOE and stuff it look, don't don't judge my logic, okay? Slime. Alright, let's try the flash bow first. See what it does. Eh, it's not that bad. It's not horrible. I mean it's pretty strong. Oh, it's definitely got an AOE. See that's why I wanted to choose a slime. So we can choose see the AOE. So that was the flash bow. It's not bad. Also, I forgot to turn on the setting. Hang on one second. Okay, griefing is now on. That's what I needed. That way we can see the damage these bows do. So there's our unexpecting slime, and this is the earth bow. Let's see what it does. Well, I mean... Oh. <laughs> okay, the earth bow. I like it. It's not bad. It, uh... Throws your enemies up in the air. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's try to... Alright. Little guy, I'm sorry. Oh! I like it. I like it. That's a fun one. Alright, next one. Multi-shot bow. I wonder what it could do. Hmm. Multi-shot. Hmm. Yeah. I mean... Oh. I was gonna say if you can't aim, this is a great bow for you, but apparently I can't aim and I still missed, so... Not that great. Yeah, it just shoots a crap ton of bows. Hmm. Next one. Fireball. Oh, well. It sounds cool. Does, does a little bit of damage. Ow! Just a little bit. Shoots a fireball. Exactly like it says. Also, keep in mind, these are all craftable. There's a complete survival world full of these. But I just wanted to check these out in survival so we can see what they're all about. So spawn in our unsuspected guy, and let's try red laser! Okay, that is actually really, really strong. Okay. Okay, you know what? Red laser. If you're looking for a bow that does a lot of damage, it does a lot of damage. Next up, we have the lightning bow. I wonder what it could do. Yeah. Who would have thought? It shoots lightning. Yeah. But you can also do this with it. You're welcome. That was the lightning bow. Moving on. Next up, we're going to shoot a mob with a mob. Mobception. We got the creeper bow. Yeah. Just shoots a crap ton of creepers. Warning. Could do a lot of damage to your base shoot with care. So next up we have the diamond sword. Whoa. Yeah, it, it shoots a diamond sword. I'm not even joking. Yep. Oh, diamond sword. Not the most powerful thing in the world, but uh, it'll do. And we're back with an unsuspected slime and an asteroid bow. Let's see what this one does. Ah. You can summon asteroids from the sky. Kind of random on where they fall, but yeah. You can definitely do that. Now we have the knockout. Knockout? Knockback bow. Let's see what it does. Okay, I'm not sure if that was more deadly for the slime or for me, considering it threw me back half a feet. Half a feet? A bunch of feet. You know what? I can't talk. Hey, you good sir. You want to test this? Okay, knockback bow. Yeah, um... Maybe if you crouched, it's better? Sure. This one just seems like an accident waiting to happen. Actually, a lot of these seem like an accident waiting to happen. Yeah. Don't use this one when around a ravine. You'll be sad. Next up, rainbow bow! Whoa. Not only does it sound cool, it looks freaking awesome. Whoa! And yes, some of these have uh, boosts that come with them, if you've noticed that. I forgot to even mention that. 
Look, I'm a bit scatterbrained. Okay, give me a break. It's been a lot of recording fails. And I'm very sad. But this makes me happy. Next up, Vortex Bow. Ooh, very quick draw. Whoa. Does that just kind of throw him around? Oh yeah, this one just kind of throws your enemy around. It's visually kind of pretty. Whoa. Okay, don't get near it though, it kind of hurts. Next up, blue laser. We had red laser, now we have blue laser. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Um. Okay, so if you hold hold it, it just goes ballistic. Oh. My. God. Uh. Assuming you have infinite ammo, you'll never lose a war with this one. Because you can literally just... Yeah. 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 That's one of my favorite. Moving on. Alright, we are back. This time, we have... A pink laser. Oh. Okay. Pink laser just does a crap ton of explosive damage. Okay, yeah, that this one. Wait. Yeah, it has a little charge attack. Moving right along, we have the mega explosive bow. I can't imagine what this one will do. Um. Okay. Yup. Mega explosive bow. Does exactly what you think it would do. You want to remove a lot of mass? Well. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely the one for you. Alright. Moving right along. Okay. Outside the gates of chaos, where I have definitely made a mess of stuff, we have the ice bow. Oh. <laughs> Which apparently creates ice. Yeah. Interesting. Another bow that I could see going wrong very fast. Oh, and it slows you down. Oh, there's a slowdown. Cool. Kind of cool bow. I mean, definitely a cool bow. I wonder if it works for, like, can you walk on it? Oh. Ooh, interesting. Very interesting. Oh. Okay, moving right along. Uh... Okay, this time I have the Enderman bow. And unfortunately... No, unfortunately the sheep's gonna have to make a sacrifice. Oh. The Enderman bow. I think I get it. This one's not really for damage. This one's just for getting around. I got it. Kind of cool. Very cool, actually. And we're back once again. I keep saying that. I don't know why. But you know what? It's whatever. So now we got the fire ring bow. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh. Okay, this one may may not be, yeah, not good use. Don't use this one. This one's just gonna start a fire everywhere. I can see it now. Imagine you're just like, oh, I gotta protect my base. And then that happens. Yeah. Moving on. I don't think this one would be best suited around player bases. This is the player cannon bow. Um. Yeah. Interesting. So this one is definitely for getting around the map pretty quickly. I like it. Next up, we have the Dark Bow. Oh my god. Okay, so this one's like a machine gun. And it does a lot of damage. Now this one I'd definitely use around my base because it doesn't seem to do any like actual physical damage. Which is kind of useful. Yeah, Dark Bow. Definitely like it more. Next up, End Dragon Breath Bow. 
Ooh, that noise. Ah. So it's just kind of an AoE. It's kind of like poison, I guess, if you want to. You want to say that. Pretty. Pretty. And it's not super devastating to the surrounding area. I would use this one a little bit more, probably, than the others. Uh, I cannot see myself using the um, Mega Explosive Bow anytime soon, though. Not around a base. Next up, Exploding Pig Bow. Uh. That's kind of a strange one. Oh, okay, so this one's like you shoot it at their feet. And it places something. Interesting. Next up, we have the arrow explosive bow. Oh. <laughs> okay, I like this one. This one could definitely be used for clearing out a room. Oh yeah, I like this one. It's kind of like an air burst. Interesting. I like it. Moving on. Next up, levitation bow. Can't imagine I... Well, I don't even know where I was going to go with that. You know what? I just can't imagine. Oh. Interesting. Huh. I wonder if that damages me. Mm, probably, but I'm in creative mode. So, test at your own risk. Kind of cool, though. I'll be back with the last bow. Last bow is the automatic bow. Ah, it's a little bit loud, I'm not going to lie, but it does exactly what it says. It is just pure auto-fire. Yeah. Yeah, this one could definitely be dangerous, and I would use it around my base because it doesn't do any uh, actual damage. It does slow you down, though. Kind of like a Gatling gun. Interesting. Anyways, well, that is all the bows. I hope I can compress this down into one video. If not, it may be two. I don't know. We'll find out. So, yeah, if you like this video and you like these uh, these bows, be sure to check it out on the Minecraft store. Again, it costs like five bucks or something like that. And you can use it in survival. Which, if you want to see me use these in survival, let me know. I wouldn't be opposed to it. And, yeah, with that, I bid you a goodbye.